Yo, what's up guys, it's Oreo. I'm hitting you with the Sasuke the Last combo guide. Um, I really do like Sasuke the Last. He's probably one of the best characters to use in the game. He's like God tier. Um, so for this build, I'm gonna be showing you two. It's the, you have the Fireball one and then you have the Onyx Shidori one. Um, if you're gonna be using Sasuke as like mainly for support, I suggest you stick with the Fireball one. If you're gonna use him for, uh, just to play as him, and use him as the main, I suggest you use um, Chidori, the Onyx Chidori, just because it's fast, it does a lot of damage, and you can get it almost in all his combos, and you can do the Fireball one in all his combos, but the Onyx Chidori just looks better. Um, so I start off with just like the main thing, he has an infinite combo, it's, uh, it's just a neutral combo, right there after he does the pull, you can just start that. And with that, that infinite combo can open up a lot of things. You can go that into fireball, you can go that to jump fireball, you can go into that with the uh, tilt, the almighty push, and you can go into that with his ultimate jutsu, a grab, um, he just has a lot of stuff. If you wanna, if you wanna do it faster, you can kill cancel. But yeah, you guys get the gist. I'm um, I'm a recent man. Let's put them in the middle. <clears throat> All right, so I'll show you guys what the combos look like. That's the regular fireball on the ground. <clears throat> I don't really suggest you guys do that one. It's it's kind of slow and you're unsafe. I rather you guys do it in the air. The air one works way better. You're off the ground. Um, so you're probably able to hit their supports a lot better if they call them out. And let's see the grab. You don't have to jump with the grab. Um, sometimes when you cancel, you like cancel in like a different um, spot. I'll show you what that looks like. Like you can cancel out all the way over there and then you can't get the grab and you just wasted like a prime opportunity. Um, to do the And that is the tilt, and I'll do the ulti. Um, with the ulti, don't cancel. Do not cancel. If you cancel, you might go either the wrong way and it doesn't hit, or you might um, dash right past the person. I noticed that with um, this Sasuke, like he's like, I guess slippery. Like he goes right past the person sometimes um, when you actually cancel and do it. So I suggest you guys don't do that. Um, combo wise uh keep in mind that you do have these these are good combo enders um it does it's a knockback it takes a good it doesn't really do like a good amount of damage except if you have like overtime damage on the effects on then it does a fairly good amount so you can go and just go into that and that's that did a good amount of damage and if they don't have any subs you know double up on it You basically taking bars of help away. Uh, let's see his down combo. Ah, oh, she's. Um, usually that's how I end all my. I don't like doing finishers, like to finish the combos, because they just. I'll always like to stay on guard, so usually I'm always canceling my combo and jumping or blocking, whatever. So I always finish them with, you know, a tag. Just cause it's it just quick, it does a lot of damage and it does overtime damage. So you guys should keep that in mind too. Um, I'll show you some quick relay setups. Uh, with Sasuke, I would rather him have like a, a paper tag that doesn't do like the damage like the fire tag does. But you can also do them with relays. You can throw these and get a relay in. Um, so you can do air air combo setups. And go into relay and those are pretty much safe if they don't move out the way or if they if they don't counter it then they get hit by it um rarely have i seen somebody chakra dash the relay that fast and get away with it um and usually when people drop back down they normally start to block they don't attack so it's a pretty safe uh, 
combo to do. So always keep in mind that you can just jump through that and get the relay in, and it usually always works. Up combo. Yeah, see that doesn't that doesn't hit. And um, I've been having trouble getting that to hit. I don't think it does because the combo kind of like resets. But um, you can just go into like an air combo. Um, so yeah, usually when you juggle like that, if they don't hit the ground and it doesn't go into an air combo, what you want to do is just do a quick chakra dash because it sends you in the air, throw these, and then go into relay. That always works every single time. I cannot stress that. It always works. Like, put that in your memory. That if you're attacking them on the ground and they're slightly in the air, chakra dash, throw this out, relay. Hits every time. And, um, kind of keep in mind is that if they're in the air, if you time it right, you can just get that into the relay, and they usually drop down block, and it's always safe, unless they call out a support. Um, another thing I noticed, I'll show you with the Onyx Chidori, because it's a pretty cool thing. Um, it was also in my Naruto, the last tutorial, is that if you do a Jutsu and you cancel it, the grab after that is really fast. Um, so you can just do a Jutsu cancel grab, and... It's very fast, and because of the effects that are in the game, you don't really see it coming at all. We're gonna switch. Let's beat up uh, Obito. Alright, so um, let me see if I can get on the block. Fuck. Damn it. I got something. I get him to block his face. You see how fast that is? You guys don't even you probably don't even know what happened. Um I threw I threw this for him to block and then I did Onyx Chidori and I canceled my Chidori right when I was in front of him and uh I hit the grab. So it is very fast. I cannot stress it. You just, you get it off every single time. And nobody ever thinks that you're gonna like, do a grab right after, and they're already blocking, so if they don't do something in that split second, they're either in the grab, or they're uh, they're just not doing anything to you. Um, so it's pretty safe. Oh, fuck, no. Let me see, what was it? I don't think you have to cancel with his. Yeah, you don't have to cancel, just do the jutsu. But you kind of have to, like, pause your combo to do it. Yeah. So just press circle three times and then uh, don't touch circle again. Do the chakra, wait till they come back towards you, and then do it. Um, and this one, the reason why I suggest you use this one, because it does, it's quick damage. Like, this combo right here is so quick. And uh, you can just do that and get the U2 off of that, and it takes a major amount of damage. And plus, that combo is just infinite. So if they don't have any subs, you can just double, even triple off of this. And then go into Chidori. Like, it's it's just amazing. Let me see if we can get it. I don't think it's, I don't think it works on up combo. Nah. But you can do the same thing with the, uh, the Chidori, Chidori grab technique. And then and then get the grab off of that. It's a pretty good grab setup. The only problem with it is that it does waste chakra. 
Um, so if you have a team where like you can absorb a lot of chakra, like the plus ones, and then they come out and help you uh, gain chakra, then you'll be fine. If you don't have that, then I, um, you should probably like not use the Pokemon. But um, that's pretty much for Sasuke that I know about, or that I figured out. Uh, I'm not sure who I'll do next. Um, whoever you guys want me to do, drop a uh, suggestion. But I'm mainly doing like the news characters so far. And then once I get all of those done, I create a guide for the other ones. So uh, if this video helped you out, slap a like on it. Subscribe. I'm almost at 2K, so the hype is real. I'm Metaorium. Thanks for watching.